hey guys what the heck is up so welcome back to another one of my video since it's fall spooky season whatever you want to call it i decided to do some fall themed pinterest diys so i typed in fall recipes and one of the first things that came up was vegan like paleo whatever pumpkin banana cookies so I was like, okay, there's a few ingredients. Why not try it out, see how it goes, see what the results are. Let's get down to the kitchen. So the first thing I did was preheat the oven to 350 degrees. So here are the ingredients. And um, the first thing I did was take um, one medium banana and just mash it all up to make it into a puree. Then I measured out three fourths cups of pumpkin puree. Now I looked everywhere for tapioca flour, couldn't find it, so I just looked up an alternative and I found all-purpose flour, so I just ended up using a half cup of that. And then two tablespoons of coconut flour, a fourth teaspoon of baking soda, and one teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice. And like the recipe says to do, I blended all the ingredients except for the chocolate chips together in a mixer. I added a third cup of dark chocolate chunks. You could add dates, but I'm a chocolate lover, so I decided to add dark chocolate chunks. After mixing in the chocolate, the recipe says you can now place the cookies onto parchment paper on a baking pan to bake. And it's said to try to press them to make them into circles, but the batter was just so sticky that this wasn't possible for me, so I just tried my best. Then bake them at 350 degrees for 10 minutes and the recipe says they should be done after cooling off of course <laughs> so i have them right here so it was hard for me to like press them down like into a circle like they said so it kind of came out looking chunky it smells a lot like pumpkins let's try it Overall, it tastes decent. Like, they taste good. But, I wouldn't really associate this with a cookie. Because it's not that sweet. Um, it tastes more like a bread. The consistency of it is more like a bread. So, if you like that, go for this. It's a great recipe. Also, if you don't like things really sweet. For me, like cookies, when I think of a cookie, I think of sugar. And I want something sweet. Um, in the recipe, they had a decision where you could do chopped up dates or chocolate chips, and I did dark chocolate chips. Um, but dates are actually pretty sweet, so if you want to try this out and you want it to be sweet, I would just say maybe try dates. I would give the recipe a 5, the overall product probably a 7, just because it does taste good, but it would just be better if it was labeled not as a cookie, because it's not what you expect. But like, definitely try it out. Try it out with dates if you want, um, to make it sweeter, but... Um, yeah, that's it for this video. Make sure to give this video a like if you liked it. Um, subscribe for more videos below and comment video requests. And I hope you all have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye!